Welcome to our training video for Unit Take Orders. Unit Take Orders are placed by the unit leader to fulfill your scout's undelivered sales. There are two ways you can access Unit Take Orders. The first option is to click on View Unit Orders from the dashboard. This is found on the right-hand side as demonstrated within the video. The second option is to click on Unit Orders in the main menu on the left-hand side of the screen. Both links will lead to the same screen. Here, you can see all open unit orders you currently have in place. To create a new unit order, click on Create Unit Order. If you currently manage more than one unit, you may need to select the unit of which you would like to place a unit order for. Next, choose the relevant sale. In the context of this video, we will be using the 2024 Take Order Sale. If you have already started a unit order that's incomplete, you will see another screen is showcased in this video prompting you to continue the unit order that's currently opened. Upon clicking the correct button for the sale that you want to create an order for, you will be taken to the setup of the order. On the contact tab, the contact information will be pre-filled with information from your unit. You can update this information as necessary before clicking next. On the product selection screen, you will see a column showing the total quantity of each product within your unit's inventory. Additionally, you will see a column indicating the quantity of each product that scouts have not delivered. The column that's highlighted in the video is what we are referring to, current quantity needed from undelivered scout take orders. Next, enter the order quantity. Typically, this will be the quantity needed from the undelivered scout take orders, minus any leftover inventory your unit has on hand. Note that your quantity may be rounded up to the nearest case quantity, depending on the type of order and your council's policies. After entering your order quantities, scroll to the bottom and click Next. On the summary screen, confirm your quantities and click Submit to Council. If you need to make changes to your order, just go back to the Products tab and adjust the applicable products slash quantities.